Hello everyone. Here is the recipe of the oldest Hyderabadi or Nawabi dam alu which is in a traditional way with a rich nutty flavor. You can make this dam alu with a larger potatoes or with a baby potatoes. Firstly, clean well and peel 8 medium sized potatoes. Cut them into 2 halves. Make a few cuts on the potato with a toothpicker or with a fork. Into a hot skillet goes a spoon of coriander seeds, a tablespoon of cumin seeds, half a tablespoon black pepper corn, one in cinnamon, one star anise, three to four clove, three cardamom, twenty cashew, handful of almonds, and half a tablespoon of fennel seeds. Dry roast them well until the aroma essence coming out. Let them cool down, transfer to a blender jar and make a fine powder. To this powder, add 2 to 3 tablespoon of dry coconut powder and a quarter cup of milk. Blend again to make into a fine paste. This is the special spice mix that gives a flavorable essence to the damalu. Into the potatoes goes a cup of fried onion, half a cup of yogurt, 2 to 3 split green chilies, a tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, half a tablespoon turmeric, 1 tablespoon chili powder, handful of coriander leaves, handful of mint leaves and the blend paste. Mix all the ingredients well. For the final touch, add around quarter cup of desi ghee, a salt to taste. Finally, 3 to 4 strands of saffron. Transfer this mix into a frying pot or a pan. Close with the foil paper or seal the lid with the wheat or roti dough. Place a lid on top and keep on them. Cook on only on low to medium flame for about 25 to 30 minutes. Ensure the potatoes cook well without adding a water. Once the cooking is done, open the lid and check the potatoes are cooked or not. If not, just keep in additional 5 minutes in them. And there you have your delicious Nawabi Damalu, the rich aroma and flavor. Enjoy this delicious Nawabi Damalu along with the roti or with the jeera rice or with the ghee rice please give a try to this recipe at home and leave a comment how it turned out please do like share and subscribe Thank you for your time. Happy cooking. Namaste.